guys. It's out here to do a quick uh, run up and down the street real quick in front of my house. The 62 pinion, no, 62 spur gear. And uh, 35 tooth pinion. So, let's see, my uh, hobby wing, uh, 3200 KV motor. See, uh, I got a little GPS inside. <laughs> Look at this crazy cat. We got birds chasing this car, cats chasing this car. <laughs> guys it's definitely got power now compared to that stock <laughs> it's definitely got more power there, fellas. Gonna get on a get on a street where uh, I can open her up or a parking lot. It's uh, oh, oh, that was my toe. Oh, that was my toe. <laughs> oh, that was my beautiful body. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I'm going to have a crease in it now. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's all messed up now. Hopefully, I didn't break it. I think I broke something. All right, guys, let me take it inside and go check it out and see what it was. <laughs> Something's sticking out. I'll be back. All right, I'm back. It was uh, my GPS fell out. So that was 32 miles an hour just up in the street. So I don't know. it feels like it's a lot faster than that. Just so uncontrollable. body's leaning or something. I need to take it inside and go check it out. There's something wrong with it. Alright. Move all this stuff out of the way. Alright guys, I'm back. I'm back in the garage. I don't know if you can tell, but I don't know what happened here, but the body's sitting way down. It's almost like I lost a shock or something or, or something like that. The body's sitting over Pick you out of this thing so you can see. Feel the body sitting over the retire. Should be sitting up a little bit like that. So let's uh, take the body off. See what stupid thing I just did. <laughs> I even, even bent my body clip all up. <laughs> that was pretty brutal. I don't see nothing wrong with the oh yeah okay wonder how that oh that's supposed to go straight through there's what happens see ya that one's straight this one's bent up in the air so I might need a new I'll probably really try to be able to straighten it but I'm gonna just order a new one of those. Oh, I just popped it. That's what it did. It pulled the screw out right here and popped it up. There's a screw right here. 
on this one and I just pulled it out. So let's see if we can get in the screw right here. You see that? Which is good, I think. Hopefully it didn't strip it out. Hopefully that's what it's supposed to do. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. I don't think it's supposed to do, do that loose because this side's not. Hmm. Pull this apart. See if we can get you a better angle. See what I did. I could just I don't know what happened there. Just kind of pulled out of that thing. Doesn't seem like it broke anything though. Just popped out. This is all just adjustments for this to so you can move. Uh, uh, move the, oh, I see. So that's all that is. Is an adjustment. So it must have just popped up. must have just popped up and came out of that hole is what happened and moved over a little bit. So that's all. Okay. I think we're, uh, I think we're okay. Find the screw now. There it is. Oh, let's turn this off. <clears throat> Alright, so that's no big deal. We'll put that together. You don't have to watch me do that. But, I mean, I'm not... Only 32 miles an hour there. So it's on a 2S, guys, 2S. So when it had a lot more speed, I just couldn't keep it that there. So and uh, these tires are like slick. Um, I don't know, like I said, I think we'll go to a open parking lot. If there's a Kmart over here where I live and it's got nobody there, we'll go there one day run this thing, see if we can find a straight area with nobody around. So that street, I'm afraid that street I'll be hitting curbs, but it's pretty wide, so I might go test it on that street and see. I just gotta learn not to touch the, <laughs> not to touch the brake and not to touch the steering, just let it roll out. That's what you gotta learn, so. All right guys, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe. And uh, next time we should be running this thing to us and see exactly what it can do. And then definitely want to stick a three S in there. And I know it's just going to burn the tires up. I think I'm, I'm, I'm going to get foam for these, but so it sticks a little better, but I am just not sure which ones to get yet. So, cause I got the contact foams and they're, uh, the, the back ones are skinny. I can't get the fat ones on the back i can only put the skinny one so i think i'm gonna do skinny front skinny back and see if that works because they're what ten dollars a set so i'm gonna try it that way so like i said all right thanks guys thanks for watching uh appreciate y'all and uh you have a good day